Australian frogs. They may not be cute and cuddly, but frogs are an important part of Australia's creeks, rivers and wetlands. If frogs start disappearing from the landscape, it is a sure sign that it's time to take better care of their watery homes. Frogs are cold-blooded animals that belong to a group of animals called amphibians, which means they live in water and on land. Australia has 208 frog species. Frogs need to keep their skin moist or they could dry out. They do this in different ways. Some live near water bodies, in shady vegetation or rock faces. Some cover their skin in a slimy substance and some even burrow into the soil. Humans are a danger to frogs. Our towns and cities are destroying frog habitats. What can you do to help protect our frog species? One, take care when visiting national parks disturb as little as possible. Two, do not remove frogs or tadpoles from the wild. Three, do not touch frogs. This can pass on deadly diseases. And four, do not disturb rocks and logs. It could be the habitat of frogs. The life cycle of a frog. Female frogs lay their eggs in water in large clumps called spawn. Tadpoles hatch from the eggs, swim and breathe using gills. At six weeks, external gills disappear and the tadpole breathes air with lungs. At eight weeks, the hind legs form. At 12 weeks, the front legs form, the tail shrinks and the froglet can leave the water. The frog's tail is totally absorbed by its body and the frog lives on land. Eventually, it will find a mate. The female will lay the eggs the male will fertilise them and the whole process will begin again.